praise you, Father. You are good. Your grace and your mercy endures forever. Endeavor is your faithfulness. Praise you, Father. You are good. Your grace and your mercy endures forever. Endeavor is your faithfulness. Praise you, Father. You are good. Your grace and your mercy endures forever. Endeavor is your faithfulness. Hallelujah. Shout out to Brother Soldier. Psalm 69. Psalm 69. Starting at verse 8. For your sakes, for your sake I suffer insults. This is, of course, written by King David. Psalm 69. For your sake I suffer insults. Shame cover my face. I am estranged from my brothers and aliens to my mother's children. Because zeal for your house has eaten me up, and on me are falling insults of those who are insulting you, and on me are falling the insults of those who are insulting you. I weep bitterly, and I fast, but that too get insults. I clothe myself with sackcloth to become the object of scorn, the gossip of those sitting by, their, by the town gate, the theme of drunkard songs. The gossip of those sitting by the town gate, the theme of drunkard songs. As for me, Yahweh, let my prayer come to you, come at an acceptable time. Let my prayer to you, Yahweh, come at an acceptable time. In your grace, Yahweh, answer me with the truth of your salvation. Rescue me from the mud. Don't let me sink. Let me be rescued from those who hate me. Let me be rescued from those who hate me and from the deep water. Don't let the flood waters overwhelm me. Don't let the deep water swallow me up. Don't let the pit close its mouth over me. Answer me, Yahweh, for your grace is good. In your great mercy, turn to me. Don't hide your face from your servant, for I am in trouble. Answer me quickly. Come near me. Redeem me. Ransom me because of my enemies. You know how I am insulted. Shamed and disgraced. Before you stand all my foes. Insults have broken my heart. Insults have broken my heart. To the point that I could die. I hope that someone would show compassion. But nobody did. And that there would be comforters. But I found none. They put poison in my food. They put poison in my food. In my thirst, they gave me vinegar to drink. Let their dining table be for them become a snare. When they are at peace, let it become a trap. Let their eyes be darkened so that they cannot see. Let their bodies always be stumbling. Put, pour out your fury upon them. Let your fear anger. Let your fierce anger overtake them. Let your fierce anger overtake them. Let the place where they live be desolate. For persecuting someone you had already stricken. Listen, man. King David said, Let the place where they live be desolate with no one to live in their tents. Why? For persecuting someone that Yahweh did, that Yahweh did already restrict that already stricken. For persecuting someone that Yahweh did already struck. For persecuting somebody Yahweh already corrected. For adding to the pain. Of those you wounded. And Yahweh already judging some of us, man. We ain't supposed to be adding to that. Add verse 27. Add guilt to their guilt. Don't let them enter into your righteousness. Erase them from the book of life. Let them not be written with the righteous. Meanwhile, I am afflicted and hurt. God, let your saving power raise me up. I will praise Yahweh. With a song, I will extol him with thanksgiving. This will be Yahweh. This will please Yahweh more than a bull with its horns and hoofs. The afflicted will see it and rejoice. You seeking after God, let your heart be revived. Right? Those of us seeking after the most high, let our hearts be revived. For Yahweh pays attention to the needy and doesn't scorn his captive people. Let heaven and earth praise him, the seas and Whatever moves in them, for God will save Zion, but he will and he will build the cities of Judah. His people will settle there and possess it. The descendants of his servants will inherit it, and those who love his name will live there. Those who love his name will live there. 
We pray to Yahweh, you are good. Your grace, your mercy endures. One of the brethren, you know, you know who you are, man. Started off with this 69. And, uh, man, I felt led in the spirit to finish it up. It's really important. Y'all got to open up that script, man. Open up that book. Bend your knees. Open the 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 book. Then open your mouth. Bend your knees. Then open the book. Repent. For the kingdom of heaven is near. Right at the door.